Hi, I'm Alice and I'm here at the University of Derby Hall of Residence. I'm visiting today to find out what life is like in halls for our students. Let's head inside now. We're going to meet Kirk, who's the manager of these halls, and he's going to show me around. Hi, Kirk. Hi, Alice. Hi. How are you doing? Are you okay? Nice to meet you. Nice yes, to meet you really too. Good to see you. So, Kirk, we're here. Um, we're outside. A beautiful courtyard. Yeah, we're surrounded by trees. Yeah. How many rooms have you got in this hall of residence? So, in this hall of residence, we've got 245 rooms. Yeah. Um, it's a uh, completely ensuite on these halls, but we, across the portfolio, we have halls that are standard, where they have a shared bathroom and you have other halls which have an ensuite like this one here. So we're in a lovely outdoor space here. There's plenty of car parking here, Kirk. Can students bring their own car to university? Uh, they can if they apply for a car parking permit, but we sort of encourage students not to bring a car unless they absolutely have to, because um, the university itself has uh, got a free bus service. So you just flash your student card and then you'll be able to get all the way to the university campus at Kettleston Road. Yeah. You'll also be able to get to the other campuses as well. And the bus stop will either be right outside your halls or a very, very short walk just down the road. Um, we also have bike sheds as well, which are free. And all the campuses and halls of residence, they're all quite close together, aren't they? Absolutely close. You can walk between each halls of residence. You walk to all the campuses. I mean, if it's a nice sunny day, then I always encourage students to walk up to the Kettleston Road. I would do myself, so. Yeah, brilliant. Shall we go inside and have a look around? Yeah, absolutely. Come Great, on. thanks. So this is the site office. Each halls of residence has a site office. And there'll be a hall manager in there, or as we've got right now, is he one of our residential assistants? Um, students can come here and raise any concerns they might have, ask any questions. I noticed on the way in, it's very secure. I couldn't get in without you coming to let me in. How, how, do, you, how do you keep students safe within the building? You can't get into the building uh, without a fob to get into the main block. You've then got a key which will get you into your flat door, and then another key which will get you into your room. So it's very secure. We've also got 24 um, hour staffing here on site. So, Kirk, what happens in here? Right, well, this is one of our common rooms. Um, all of the halls of residence have a common room. Most of them will have a pool table. Some of the slightly larger ones will have a table tennis table. But it's just a place for students to come and relax. Maybe have a few friends round, they might come in here and if they want to make a slightly more noise than they do in their actual flats, then they can do that in a common room. We also have halls events here. Um, we have music nights all sorts going on and it's all provided for the students for free. So tell me what sort of facilities do we have in the in the flats? They, they, in, you've got in the kitchen, you have a microwave, we provide a toaster, we provide a kettle. And with five or six people living in a flat together, um, you know, I've done it myself, it's you know, who, who made that mess, who's responsible for this, how do um, how do things stay clean and tidy and organised in, yeah. in flats? So there's, there's a couple of ways, well the first is that we uh, provide cleaning for the kitchen um, in all of our halls of residence, once a week a cleaner will come and clean the kitchen for them. The other side of it is, is more sort of communal living, so students will learn to live with each other, learn to clean up after themselves. All important life skills that they need to learn and, and this seems yeah. like a nice, safe and supportive place to do that. Yeah, it completely is and like I say, we, we, we treat the students like they are, they're adults and we like to encourage them to resolve any problems they have amongst themselves but also we understand that living with four or five new people can be challenging sometimes and that's why we're there to support the students through that experience. Hi guys, how are you going? Uh, yeah, I've just got Alice here, she just wants to ask you a few questions about what it's like living in the halls. Do you like to give her a bit of your time? Yeah, yeah sure. It's amazing. Cheers, Alice. Thank you ever so much for, for letting me into your flat like this. Oh, you're um, welcome. What's it like living in halls? Honestly, really good. <laughs> Can't lie. Um, mates for life, close to campus close to city centre. So for any students who might be living potentially close enough just to commute in and not try and live in Derby, what would you say to them? Yeah, I had that option and I'm really glad I went with halls because you just get put with people straight away and you get to meet friends straight away and you're really part of the action. And what would you say is the best thing about living in halls, all of you? Friendly staff, Kirk's always smiley, always happy. He's always, he's always that like person that you can go to if like anything's wrong. Now you know I've I've seen your kitchen, I've seen your communal spaces. Would any of you mind giving me a little look around your bedroom so we can see what the bedroom spaces look like? Yeah, sure. Do you want to follow me? So this is a standard ensuite room at Peak. Um, you got a small double bed, more than more than enough for your students. Uh, a desk big enough for your work, games, books, anything you need. Got a more than big enough wardrobe behind you and a ensuite with a shower and toilet. Brilliant, it's really lovely. So that's our halls of residence, a safe, supportive and well located place to live for students. Visit our website to find out more about all our different halls. Mm -hmm.